to it getting this started. Waiting for a stream to come up where I can hear how it's doing. Just a second. Alright. Welcome everybody to Amnesia the Dark Descent. Um, for everyone on Twitch who watches like after live, um, there is a sec there is another Amnesia before this, but it's just like a few I think it's just a few minutes. Um, I had some issues with recording. A lot of background noises coming through that shouldn't have been uh, for every. I'm just gonna pause this real quick for everyone who does hear a like fan in the back. I do apologize. It is hot. Um, it's on low. You know, I don't have good air circulation back here. Um, I currently live in a camper, so it's like heat box. <laughs> Welcome back to Amnesia Dark Descent, guys. I don't know if we're going to finish the episode in this one, but uh, I am looking forward to this. This series has been getting great traction on the channel, and I really love seeing it. And I hope you guys really enjoy this episode. And with that, let's get into it. Thank you for everyone who's come to join me today live. Actually, give me just a sec. Let me make sure no background noise is coming through. Okay, I think just a slight noise in my fan, but that's okay. Alright, let's get into this. Uh, so we are in, looks like the waterway, at least under. Whoever's stuck, its gears need to be greased. Great. No. Okay, too deep to keep her safe. I don't want to do another water monster. That, that, that broke my heart almost, man. Okay, so what do we do here? Is there like something we need to move? Or... Is this... Gears need to be greased. That just takes me back. so confused right now. Shit. Alright, let's go back, I guess. Let's see. I am more confused than when we started this. This is very unfortunate. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. If all the pipes maybe they'll lead me to something. Nothing over here. Okay. 
That still won't budge. Some, it got somewhat damaged by the end. Oh, I see. Ah, that's a strong ass wood ladder. Yeah, me and Will have gotten back into Conan recently, guys. I'm not trying to give anyone hope for a new series, because it hasn't been the best so far. We're having, we're finding it really hard to get into, but we are trying. We want to try out more of the PvE aspect, like fighting world bosses and stuff. We still on, are on a PvP server. Whoa. Herbert! An old friend back in Algiers gave me a map. Why isn't he with us? Didn't he want to come? He wanted to, Daniel, but things don't always turn out the way we planned. Man, I gotta find Herbert again. Save an exit and come back, because so I think I'm supposed to be able to pick that up. This isn't something that, like, I needed to get, because I genuinely just can't pick that up. I see. Okay, so I can spin these. What did that do?
getting that. I don't think I have much oil. I really don't. I see. of January 1799. The work I have put into this machine is unequaled by the reasoning of any man. The thought that generations of men have passed away since I first attempted to reconstruct the design is most tiring. The limitations of this world have made my work incredibly difficult. It has forced me to build the thing almost a hundred times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate, not to mention the flow of tamed lighting crudely replaced by pressured steam pushing its way through the pipes and turbines shames me to think of what the inventor would have thought of my monster. Where he works with a magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I push five men to erect a tower of wrought iron in the hope it will have even the tiniest scent of power found in, the traveler's, in a traveler's locket. Stuck in its position. Okay, I think that's good. That's really good. <laughs> We're gonna get some Atlas footage too, guys. We got raided today and I didn't get to catch it, unfortunately. So what the fuck is this? Oh god, do I have to bring all the pipes I've seen? This is gonna be tedious. Doesn't sound too bad, does it, Mike? No. All right. So we need two more. I'm 
to try it. That does that. Alright, we're at the last pipe and we'll find out. Oh, the last pipe is in here somewhere. Last point be. I'm so confused right now. It's gotta be like a, um... Hold on. Yes, I'm watching a thing real quick. Did I even need another pipe? I've got to be missing something.
Okay, hold on. Okay, so I definitely did the weight thing wrong. Yeah, okay. I'm so glad I watched that, because I would have never got this right. I... I do have to mirror it. I did this so wrong. I did it like completely opposite. so much. There we go. Yeah, there's never a fourth pipe. I would've been like forever for that. Sorry guys, I don't like watching videos when it comes to stuff like this, but sometimes I, I have to, like, in order to not spend hours and hours on the same segment, I do sometimes watch a video every now and then. I try not to, but when I'm genuinely confused. Then I'm kind of pressed for time tonight, I'm just trying to... Have a fun video. So what did that do? I'm assuming you turned on the drain or like down below. No, huh. Double doors, maybe. Huh.
Yeah, the sewer must first be drained. Fuck does one do that though? Wait, no, I've got um crank for a machine. Where have I seen a crank lever then? Or like a crank spot. is up and running, so... I don't see where... Where would I even insert a handle like this? Ow. That was my fault. I left like a fucking idiot. I'm so confused. I'm assuming this still does not but there's got to be something. No more oil is needed. I could use some oil for my lamp, actually. Fuck! Where do I go? Oil? Why is my fucking... Oh, well, shit. Oh, this is very unfortunate because I'm trying to kill me. Maybe I gotta, like, hit that wood out of that gear up top? That's, that's all I can think of. I really don't want to have to keep looking up walkthroughs. gonna actually have to take a fucking there calm down screen I've never been more lost in my life. Yep, time to look up what we're doing.
God. <laughs> How? How did I not? Light blinded him as it done said that murking to Algeria it was just as enchanting. Oh well, it wasn't that enchanting. I don't want to touch that water unless necessary. You're conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like for drinking. Eh, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mill. Exactly. Okay, we are very limited on light until we get our oil. Or until we get more oil. have anything to throw at that chain. Sorry, what? A faint murmur? What the fuck does that mean? Let the monsters continue to talk among themselves. No. Son of a bitch. 7th of August, 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenberg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground 
where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. I think... I really do think I was supposed to be able to get that piece of paper down there. Maybe not, because it's... No, because I don't have Daniel's Diary Brunnenberg, the first page. So... I don't fucking know this. I, if I don't find it, I'll find a way to backtrack that or I've missed it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Trust it. Oh! Can't touch me. I'm not fucking my man. man. Did I redirect the water somewhere, or...? Yeah! Alright, I knew that's what I had to do. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying. But Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. So... I'm having a hard time discerning if Alexander is just a bad guy in general. Or if, like, the orb made him bad. He really seems like a bad guy. I heard a growl somewhere. I don't fucking trust that. Ow! I fucking got past that! Fuck you! That 
fucking hurt. Ninth of August, 1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. I really do think I missed a page, like, further up. Unless, and like, I could be completely right about this. That page in the control room, I could not pick that up. It wasn't even glowing. Like, yeah, you saw that, right, Mike? Like, yeah, no, I, I hit every button on it, man. I'll go back later if I have to and try again. But I hit every button I could on that, and it just didn't work. Lowered the water level in the cistern to rule a new way. Hold on. New way out. Oh, okay. I think this will let me go back and go under that water. need a push. Okay, so I just need to get a raw. I'm really, I'm glad I'm looking these things up, because I think all this is bonus. I don't know. Let me go look and see if I can go down real quick. That way I, I know. I can. Alright, we need a rock. We need a rock. There we go. Where does this take me? More. Ah! 
I see. So does the morgue have a way out? Because I worked real hard to get that other way out. Do you see, Daniel? It has yielded. What? The shadow. It has? For now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. Fucking, um, oh my god. Body is different from mortis. Can't be older than the I day. hear you breathing, Daniel. Do you hear me? Have you changed your mind? It's Herbert! Herbert! Herbert got a package on him. Body is still stiff from murder mortis. Can't be older than a day. Vaccine trials. Vaccine enabling my men to work in the fungi red and sewers is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish, and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass the sewers without any risk of infection. It will do fine for prisoner transport. Okay. What the fuck was that? I fear for Daniel, for he is reckless. He is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the gate. Will he be able to accept this in the end? My love, I've seen evil in him. How am I to trust him with the truth? What cruel irony that I have to unto him what Agrippa did unto me. Hold on. I gotta send a text real quick, guys. need oil. I mean, I'll take tinder boxes. So I'm assuming I need to get this, like, uh, pyramid so I can go lower. Oh. Herbert, you been busy in here, man, on a murder spree. This video might get age restricted, guys, due to the, you know, cleaners. <laughs> Plague outbreak. The strange death among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewers, which has recently been opened up for use as means of transport, is plagued by a particular poisonous fungi. The victim seems to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness, affecting the entire body. Some of some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity, but it is clear that this that this crippled my progr progress. The prisoners die quickly, and their contaminated vitae lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. I think I, I think I'm just missing a fucking page. That sucks. Anything here I can use?
God, my nose is so itchy. So who was stuck here? And where do I go? <laughs> oh. Whoever was here busted the fuck out. She deserved it, that little bitch. Sorry game, what's happening right now? Why am I getting slower? A thin copper tube. I'm gonna try the skin. I'm not trying to look at the... What about the hollow needle? Oh, syringe. Uh, that's not how a syringe works. Oh, that's just lovely. Oh, I had to stick myself with the blood. quickly yeah what the fuck am I supposed to do just run Ow! 
God, I thought it was stuck. The beautiful old orchid seemed a testament to nature's strength. Being able to grow inside Winterberg, alas, it was Alexander's studies and care which enabled the flower to blossom. So is he a bad guy? I still can't. I gotta go back and see if I can't get that paper. Cause it's, it's gotta be that paper. It just won't let me pick it up. There's a note here somewhere, I fucking know it. I remember it clearly. Am I crazy? Did I imagine that note? I think I've gone insane, guys. Nope. It's gotta be what it is. I can't. I, I think it's just that note that I can't read. Thank God I didn't go down here before I went to that bridge. Sewer. God, please don't let there be a water monster. Alright guys, into the sewer we go. Really? We're doing this? You're fucking with me. It's 
If I crouch, I don't think I... So I can't be jumping. I'm gonna have to slow that down so I can go through, I assume, is the objective. I'm, I'm tense as fuck right now. That's a broken piece of a ladder. Where these noises are coming from, and it's freaking me the fuck out. I don't know what I've done. What are you doing? Let me go! Nobody ever returns! Let me change those real quick, guys.
picked up pipe. Where did that come from? Also, where do I go? Maybe I can jam the pipe in the that needs a pipe replaced? We're gonna take a quick bathroom break real quick, cause I gotta take a leak. So everyone, go to uh, go get your snack, some water. The rest of the dreams gonna go on a little bit longer. So be back in just a few minutes, everybody.
Alright guys, we're back. Uh, someone said in the stream, um, I think it was you Mike, right? Um, which way to try. Uh, um, we're gonna try one, we're just, gonna, we're just gonna have to keep running back and forth until we like figure this out. But uh, you said, what was it? One on each end, right Mike? Oh, hi. What, what? What's the point of that? He just immediately knew where I was? Okay, so you're right. Thanks for that, love. I'm like, I would have, I would have tried like run back and forth with so many different things trying to figure this out. So thank you for remembering that, man. Is there anything over here? While I'm here... Oh, wait. Possible to get through? Damn. I could, like, in theory, climb through. Oh, no, that's too small. Herbert! My friend! It has been so long. How are you? Daniel, turn around this instant. You are carrying the shadow with you. No, I'm carrying Herbert with me. I'm Herbert. Let us be off. Herbert, you dummy sick. You make it hard for me to walk. Okay, come on, Herbert. Sorry, where do I go from here? There's anything here I can use? Do I have any of that like explosive stuff? Come on, Herbert. Herbert. <gasps> Herbert. 
Herbert. You got this. Get him back. Yeah, yeah, you run from Herbert. You're scared of Herbert. Good job, buddy. Good job. Run. Herbert, I don't care how long it takes, man. I'm taking you with me. this. You might be a little deformed, buddy, but I'll get you home and your mom. You'll see your wife and child again. Herbert, buddy, I'm gonna leave you right here, okay? You guard this way, all right? Herbert, I trust you, buddy. I'll see you on the other side, man. There's never any escape. Things like this live with you always. How could he ever know if Henry would show up down the road or even at his house? Is he that mad? Would he do that? Don't worry guys, Herbert's back there fucking beating down that monster as we speak. So, things to the fire lit by the move. Okay, no. So you don't open. You open. You open. Let's go down you first.
Tinder boxes. Agrippa, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes? Soon. I won't even be able to move. Will laboratory your life is safe? I don't doubt that. But will it be right with me? Shall fall, you say. <laughs> You've hurried too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. Yes. That's that's not very promising at all. The sector is basically impenetrable. But I guess the why more. It could be breached by another, but Alexander broke his, I mean my own, a long time ago. Really? Then if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken ore and mend away. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leap madness, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the fire and the transept. You should be able to find them there. to bother you first, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at me. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johan Heim, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion, a tonic, to free me from this husk of mine. Okay, so we're gonna listen to the naked man tied up in the dungeon. Cornelius Agrippa, I was once quite important to you. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in this dead house for years. Who knows how many? Hundreds, I presume. Oh, okay. That's that's, that's cool. Alexander is quite impressive in many ways. But he has grown impatient. Uh, you're really, like, awfully calm for, like, talking about I the man mean, who I'm sucked your soul out. Alexander, like, shoved really it in. None of this is Johann Meyer. You never heard of Johann Meyer? My god, boy. He's probably the greatest man in history. And you don't know him? Or is it the world who has forgotten him? I mean, yeah, I'll find anything I concerning my him. Pupil. My people. No. Yes. yes, I do take pride in that man. Is it so wrong? Oh, okay. Let's go back up, and I think we I should have gone you. through I the other doors. Land which had not been plundered. Do you know Mithraeses? 
I suppose it doesn't matter. It is an old thing, building temples out of caverns. The Dark Walls being the universe, and inside are its followers. Humans watching the sky slowly turn. But the followers do have one thing to allow them a real sense of connection. Creation. The orbs. We'll definitely be back, bro, but we're gonna head up here and just see if we missed anything. See what these other ways were. Okay, tender box, which helps a lot. August 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Did that noise cut out for anyone else close to the end? Okay, so what does this do? This must be something that we have to come back to, because I don't... See, I guess we do go the same way we were going. Hold up, hold up, oh, hold on, let me get that rock. I can't, damn, I was gonna, like, trip shot that rock or something. Alright, yeah, I guess we just go back down to Agrippa. their lantern doing on all oh, not the best but we're still functioning For 92 minutes. Good to see. Hey, what up, bro? Oh, exactly. So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe the other room. There are machine parts hidden all over this place. You'll find a way to fix it. You know, you are really helpful. For like a guy stuck to a wall, you're yeah. like really helpful. Okay, this does not look like a nice thing. That leads to the chin cell, so let's head up here and see what that leads to. That is me! I know this. 
this. I've been here already. I know this taste. The taste of Damascus Rose obfuscating the truth in a dim haze. They may sweep the pieces from my memory, but my body remembers. These cuts speak volumes, even though my mind remains silent. Oh, they will be back. I think the audio is having issues keeping up with you guys. That actually jump scared me a little bit. Gotta be getting close to the inner sanctum. Just a little further. It's like Orpheus descending into the underworld. Are you hiding something? What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth, after all. <laughs> Alright, guys. We're gonna end this episode here. It's been going on for a, a bit. Holy shit. This was a fucking wild run. I think we're getting close to the end. I really do. So the next episode will probably be the last one. And I'm really excited to finish this. To start up um, Justine pretty much right after. We've got so many amnesia names we need to plow through. Just, oh man. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, go check out the channel and watch the previous videos. And maybe check out some of my other content. Thank you guys for everyone who joined me live. For everyone on YouTube who wants to see this live, um, you can come check out uh, me on Twitch at Vesper Souls. Um, you know, there's this thing. I have a Discord channel. It's uh, Vesper's Army. I have no idea how you would find that. I'm still working on trying to figure out how to get the link and stick it in the description. But if anyone knows how to do that, like, let me know in the comments down below. Because I'm really shitty at all this. <laughs> so, um, it's, I don't really have anything definite yet to let everyone know when I'm streaming. It's just kind of like a willy-nilly thing. But... Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next adventure. Goodbye, everybody.